So we already have our fuse character and a background layer just like this and we arranged it, aligned uh, it to the background. So let's work around with the character's pose now. So to do that, I'm just going to select the character layer just like this and then I'm going to go to 3D tab and select the top skeleton. So once I click on that uh, in the properties panel, you'll be able to see the poses. So I can bring this out over here as well and resize this. So once I resize it, I can see it much more clearly as well. So there are different poses, but they are a combination of animation and still poses. So for poses, just be sure to click on this icon right here and then click on the gear icon and over here, make sure that you choose poses only. So the non-animated still poses uh, pops up. So you can go over here and choose the pose you like. So let's say, for example, you want sprint, uh, sprinting right here, and you can see that it seems as if the character is about to start running just like this. So these are not animation poses, but still poses. And you can go over here and choose out different poses just like this. You can go on to on hands and toes right here, just like this. You can go to left hand on hip, Right over here, you can go for push up. So it goes for more like a push up, just like this. And you can go for on the right side, just like that. So the character is resting up. So let's say I want to work around with this pose. So I can just click here and that's it. Just like that, I can work around with this. So I can then uh, just bring out the properties over here. I'm just going to keep it over here. And then here I can move around these things. So I can move around uh, the sliders right here, use the arrows to arrange it out on the place I want, just like this. And there you go, you got the character in the pose we want, just like that. So that is how you can work around with poses inside of Adobe Photoshop for the characters that we made in Fuse. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.